Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we are going to mess around and do something I hope is pretty cool and pretty interesting. So, all right, let's look at a little board design. So, all right, what is a way that we could get this to come out to the screen? We could do something cheesy like what? For I in range, what? I think I did six. Then print O space times six, right? And I run this and I get that board. But what happens if I wanted to change something here? This wouldn't work. I got it done, I got it out to the screen, but it we can't we can't change anything, we can't store it. We can't do anything of that alike. So let's let's put our thinking cap on and think about um, list of lists. So we could do something like this. So also uh, did a list of list um, list comprehension. So if this is too much, what I'm about to do, go and peek at that. Let me make sure that should be, okay. Go peek at that and then come back and look at this. So all right, we're gonna make a list and then do a list inside that. So our regular list comprehension would be like so. For I in range six, and we close that. So this is the way I like to do it. So there we go. Now, also, before we get too far into this, if you're new here, make sure you're clicking the subscribe button and the notification bell because we do have videos coming out every single day. And also, if there's anything that you, that I'm not explicitly saying is new, guess what? There is a video. And I may break in on this series a couple times to, a, to attack that. But everything that we usually do in a video, we've done before unless I explicitly state that it is new. So all right, so changing that I, we're gonna do our other list. And this will be uh, for I in range six. And then we close that out. So all right, there was our first loop. Then here is our second list comprehension. And it's just saying for each one of these, for each time through here, do that. So all right, let's run this and let's call. So here we go. But that looks a little choppy. Uh, for I in there we go. So one, two, three, four, five, six six by six so we're not quite there yet we have we have this so now we get to do some fun stuff so let's we gotta we gotta loop through this so we got a loop for I in print I now we just did that right so we're gonna get this same thing okay so we need to change this just a touch. We need to use a join. So print space join. And guess what? There's a video for that. All right, uh, close this out. Let's see how well I did. Ta-da, there we go. So just quick thing on join. It takes an iterable, throws it together, and does whatever you put here. If we were to make this Get rid of that space, make it an empty string. That's why it looks a little clunky. So, okay, so here we are. Now let's see how long we are. This isn't too bad. So, all right, now, now let's add a, let's do letters up here for our columns and numbers for our rows, columns, rows. So, all right, now we could make a list 
but we're going to use all the tools that we have from string import there we go I always spell as key wrong um, upper case as here, make sure you can see that here we go as letters so, all right uh, guess what if you don't understand this it's searchable so let's come over here and let's make sure I all right let's see what I missed and this is not a dot it is a underscore so, all right letters so here we go and we have six so a b c d e f so I need these first six so guess what we do um, what do I have this as a f equals letters through six now why six because this is this is exclusive so I'm going to save and run it again a dash f underscore f so there we go okay and then and then now I want some nums num equals range Six. So there we go. So now we have a num. That's not what we want. We want one through seven. So cool. Let's run that again. There we go. So, all right, I think this is a good stopping point right here. So, all right, here's your homework. See if you can get A through F to come up the top and one through six to come on the side because I'm actually going to break in here in next video and explain a couple of little things that we're going to tweak right here so we can get a through a through f to come at the top and one through um six to come along the side so thanks for watching please don't forget to click that like and subscribe button and most important that notification bell and please leave any comments questions or my absolute favorite any video requests below and i'll get right to them thanks guys